Hello, this is Vampire. Today's lesson is solo baston, which means single stick. The technique comes from modern Arnis, as taught by Professor Remy Presas. As usual with my videos uh, where we practice with a stick, this is going to also help with your knife combat skills. Okay, so the first part of the technique looks like this. So this is a starting position like this, and then from here we're just going to go, okay? So let me break that down. That's going to be basically a figure eight, one, two, and as you finish, as you finish the figure eight motion, you're making a circle to park it back where you started. Okay, so once again from here, you're just going to go one, two, and then finish, like just like that. So it goes one, two, and then finish like that. Figure eight and then there's a circle, just like that. Okay, uh, the second part of the technique actually goes in the reverse direction from where what we were doing right now, which means the first part that we just did, this part right here, acts as a wind-up, okay? So we're going in the this direction, where it comes from the bottom, from the bottom, and then we parked back where we came from, and from there, now we're going to go in the reverse direction to park it back underneath, okay, uh, onto the armpit. So, once again, starting position, this was the first part, was a figure eight from the bottom, and then park right here. Now we're going to unwind and park it back, okay, let's focus on the unwinding part, okay. So, once we park it here, the second part is to unwind, we're going to make a circle coming forwards this time, from the top to the bottom, this way. Okay, but notice how it comes off to the outside of my body to park it again. So let me show you again. Uh, once we come up here, it's going to come from the top to the bottom, heading this way. It's still in a circular motion, and I continue this motion to park it. Okay, so let's put it again together from the very beginning, right here. I'm going to go one, two, here, three unwind and park again so from right here one two three and back one two three and back just like this back just like this okay uh, for this next part this is where I'm going to contribute uh, back to some of these techniques and stuff. I'm not saying I am the innovator, but I personally uh, wasn't taught this. This is something I just developed on my own, which it's just logic. So, like I said, I'm sure there's plenty of people that derive to the same conclusion, or I'm sure Professor Remy Presas has taught it. It's, it's nothing new. I'm just saying that I derived it on my own. Okay, it's just logic. So, from here, we're the first part was the figure eight and then park, right? So we started here, we did the figure eight and park. And then the second part was to unwind and park back. So we're actually going in a reverse direction, which teaches momentum, which is important with the sticks or, or the knife, okay? Uh, what we're, so instead of unwinding and parking here, just like that, what we want to do is basically, you could break it down to, in stick fighting, or in knife combat or, or in this kind of style there's four quadrants that we can focus on so right now I'm here okay so this means I'm parked up here on the right upper upper right quadrant okay so this also means that from here you know I could also come down alright so this is the top part which is I parked here started here parked here so which also means I could also end up on the bottom here so from here one two three and then I can do this the smash down so basically all I'm doing is just making a circular motion to come down to smash down hard right there and you may have actually practiced this kind of warm-up so I'm just putting the two together one two three bam right there okay so this comes down and the hand it's nice to have that checking hand right there okay so this comes out right here so I cover two quadrants right here on the right side, the top and the bottom. The other logic is to go to the other side and there's a top and a bottom, so a total of four. So once I do this winding up part, I can now 
I went down, but I can also go this way to the other side. I'm, all I did was this, okay? So instead of just coming across and, and parking up here, I just added a twirl right there for extra power. If it's a blade, I'm having an extra longer uh, slash right there and concentrating in this area. So right there, okay, so that is the left upper quadrant. And then of course, we could do the bottom side. So it's just, once again, it's just simple logic. So this was the winding up part. And then from here, I can come down just like that. So you could just bring the stick down and park to the left side on the bottom, or you could do what I did, which was add that twirl. So just coming down here, and I'm adding a circular motion to increase my strike zone, and then park right here.